And that's on period. That's how you start the show? Well, I didn't know what to say because you said action and you were, you were saying something. So I had to say something like I was ready, but it's fine. It's cool, you know. <laughs> Welcome to another edition of Zero Conditions Podcast. Quincy's in the building and he's mm-hmm. drinking again. Mm-hmm. Oh, introduce me properly. I don't the biggest about broadcaster you. in Nigeria. <laughs> and Please we have... introduce me oh properly. Oh God! I would not. Oh my God! Be, so we can move that way. I would on not TV. be insulted. Okay. Yes, we can. Yes, she said the, the F word. word that yes, we oh yes, you can. You can cross his name. Sorry, broadcasters. We don't say that. So introduce me properly. The biggest broadcaster in Nigeria. We have to be be here literally, like I'm a legend. Than, I'm bigger than her, and I love her so much. She's right. one of my favorites. As a man oh, thinks it, so is he. That's what the Lord says. So hallelujah Actually, to you. Hallelujah. What's the so other part? Okay, the Lulu, Lulu is the the Lulu, Lulu is the so Lulu. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 But no, before this topic. Okay. But it's fine. Whatever. As I was about to introduce a very, very intro- introduce a very, very. Shall I help you? <laughs> Don't help me. Just shut up. Wow. I was about to introduce very a very, violent. very important person today. I've got the one. The only Timmy B. Yeah, brap, brap, brap. Brap, 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 Boy. When did Batman become Robin's psychic? Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Oh Vince my god. Wow. Boy, yes, Timmy B, how have you been? Um, hmm, that's a loaded question. Yeah. Do you want me to answer honestly? Honestly, or yes, just like please. No, 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 no. I've been like trying not to die. Really. <laughs> I, I <laughs> understand that. That's what I've been. That's how I've been. Ha ha ha, not dying today. <laughs> Ooh, that's, 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 that's how I've been. Yeah. I can absolutely relate to that. Um, but do you think that you've been trying not to die because of Nigeria or just like where you are personally? Is it I a think Nigeria it, thing? It's, Nigeria doesn't help. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But it's still like where I am in life. Just life generally isn't fun. <laughs> you know, they said go to school, study, get a job. Then everything will be great. They be rich. They lie. They did lie. They lie. There's a lot of in betweens that, that they never just told us. are not adding up. Yes, I agree with like, you. Like you have to have more than one job. Did you know that? No, they didn't tell us that. They were like, go to school, study agricultural, <laughs> be a dentist, <laughs> become a farmer. <laughs> but then you have to be a farmer. Do TikToks. It's a lot of stuff. <laughs> And you can still buy petrol. So, yeah, that's how I'm doing. <laughs> I feel like show. this is one of the most honest how I, how I did that I've gotten in a very long time. Honestly yeah. speaking, I wish everyone would answer this genuinely. No, this is that so question. genuine. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And I particularly find it tiring. Like, maybe not tiring of the word. I find it... Ugh. When you ask artists, when they come for interviews, so how are you? Like, oh, I'm fantastic, great. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you're not great. Yeah, you're And not. every time you ask them, like, how are you? Maybe at the beginning of an interview, they feel like you're just a filler. Yeah. So sometimes I have to do extra. I'm actually genuinely asking. How, how are, are you? you? Yeah. <laughs> do we like, all do that? <laughs> and they'll be like, oh. I'm like, yeah, it's not a filler. <laughs> no, but I think I find artists fascinating, especially when you have interviews. and. Yeah. Ugh, I think a lot of them just don't have any depth other than the music. But apart from that, it's like even if we they do have there. depth, I they don't want it. to give it to you. Because God forbid you're just a Nigerian registration. Do you understand? Mm. You now go abroad to breakfast club. All of a sudden, Ooh. you talk a lot. I did Actually, you. on my mother bed, she died. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, but I was with you last week. And you were like, hey, yeah, my manager said that you shouldn't say <laughs> The featuring is coming. Who do you? So it's like, it's very annoying because sometimes they think that we don't know and our job. But it's like these people are not trying to talk to you because you are not some fair color. Local rapper. And you don't have a sense. It's not, you know, it's, it's like, not really like, like a local rapper. You do understand? You go somewhere, they will call you a shake and you'll be like, yeah, actually, yeah, I'm a shake. And based on that, actually, I, I have, actually, a, I have a music with Don Jazzy or something. It's very like, Well, it's, why can't you say that here? That is. Just following the how are you? I, I it think, really goes to me. I, I, I think that's a genuine feeling. Yeah, because Omale all of a sudden had a lot to say abroad, and I was like, "Why? I love you. <laughs> I played, I played your music fast and a lot. Did you understand? Why yeah. can't you tell me this thing you are going through on this my station? 
Actually. Did you understand? You, need to, you, Actually. Need to you have to go out, but then I found that somebody saw your sound. Wow! Why didn't you tell me that? <laughs> How did we know here? <laughs> you know How did we know? It's not good. Though. Let's tell it's paid. It's paid. And let's just be honest with each other. I love you for saying that. It, yeah. It's, Come I on. Mean, we are human beings. I'm about beings. to move the conversation, but still in the same vein. I think it brings to perspective the conversation about how artists seem to revert um, a lot of the international, uh, what, international acceptance over home ground Fact. or home mm. base, Fact. which is really daft because for music business itself, a lot of the guys that have now become quote-unquote exports are losing out. That's why you have someone have a hit record internationally, globally, like gets played in Asia and things like that. And Are you talking about someone in particular? N Do you just want um, to say the name? You come to Nigeria no. and you look and then you come to, quite a lot. And then you come, t and then after that record, is struggle for the next one. But or you even come home and nobody's nobody's attending your concert. Absolutely, absolutely, and it's just it just keeps happening, right? Because and Nigeria is not money to them. They'll tell you your streams don't add up, man. You don't give me your money. It's not counting for how me. How about now? How about you tell them why are you now trying to struggle <laughs> because with Nigerian features and trying to now sing song with local dialect all what of a sudden? What are you talking about? Oh, just Quite a number. Who's the person? Quite a just number. So that we can come back to this. But tell me, do you feel now ha um, how... Okay, as someone who has been on radio for years, you've mm -hmm. been on radio for how many years now? I'm not sure, but more than 10 years, like maybe 13. More than. Mm -hmm. So you've literally seen artists, some of the biggest artists right now. You've yeah. seen them at the beginning of your career. Yeah. And one thing that, you know, people used to say back in the days, like, oh, as radio broadcasters or, yeah, as radio broadcasters, as media people, it's your job to break these songs. People are saying stuff like radio is not as important as it used to be bef back in the day because now radio is playing catch-up to popular songs. They don't break songs the way. So maybe... Oh, Hachette. Oh, her, her black stuff. Let me adjust it for you. Nothing, don't worry. It's just your light. Yeah, okay. we want to see that tattoo, baby. Okay. What are you saying? Yeah, actually. It looks sexy. So, back to the question I was asking. Um, people say that... No, so, now, the conversation, um, the, the conversation right now is that radio is playing catch-up to popular songs because radio presenters and radio don't be breaking songs the way they we used to back in the day, like, say, five, ten years, where... Radio presenters will be the first person to play a song and they will have segment for emerging artists, right? And that they don't do that as much anymore. You're really big in the radio space and you even hold a position of power aside from like your regular OAP work. Why is that happening now? And also, as someone who has seen these emerging artists grow, do you have those guys who you broke their music at the beginning or you were really supporting that are still like loyal to you? When I say loyal, I don't mean they be giving you money, but yeah. when you call them like a ah, guy, come for an interview, or do they still care that ah, this, aunt, this babe, this auntie was at the beginning for us, or do they still care about those things? I mean, some do and some don't. But I think radio is important because I, I think at the end of the day, we forget that Nigeria is not Lagos. You know, so Lagos is, you know, we're hip to it. There's a lot that we have access to, but Nigeria is not Lagos. God. Most of the population still relies on radio. Yep. So, yeah, maybe you're still on TikTok, but radio is still extremely important in Nigeria. Yeah. Other places, perhaps. But here, the mass, the population, most people yeah. still can't afford um, data and all of that stuff. That's just the reality of what we are. Mm -hmm. It just 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 basic on a basic level mm -hmm. um radio i think a lot of I, at the beats we have segments for emerging artists i am very 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 passionate about emerging artists about music in general. in general so in one way or another i'm always like rooting for them and supporting them and i think that yeah a lot of people don't care but radio does play a part yes it might not break music now but it does popularize music, music. so it's okay this song is bubbling and we pick it up and then we start playing imagine if you tune in everywhere and you hear a song it's it's not even it's forget music there's some ads as well that you Bro, just start actually, singing yes and it's because you happens just, all the time exactly so if it works for ads what more music that's like yeah. catchy yeah. So I'm going to I'm going to pick one thing you said. Radio 
is not Lagos. No, Lagos, Lagos is not Nigeria. Lagos is not night. Bro, I've been looking so for profound. the best way <laughs> to explain this whole conversation yep. in three three uh-huh. or four words. Yep. And that's the best. Because um, either you like it or not, once you cross from Lagos, you see a whole new world. The oh, conversion no. radio <laughs> the conversion radio gives is mad. Is madness. These people are still tuning in on a daily basis. It's Nigeria that's really trying to form woke or trying to catch up to whatever's happening internationally, which doesn't make any sense because the things they're doing internationally we're not particularly doing here. So we're just lost in the limbo. And then everyone comes to a conclusion that is so unenlightened because even the owners of the station said no one do things the way supposed they they're supposed to do. Yeah. For instance, you and I worked in the station back in the day. Yeah. Right. And one of the earliest things that we tried to um to bring was something we saw internationally, you know, live performance sessions and all of these things. Yeah. And I'm talking when? How long? 2019? 2018? Yeah. A very long time. No, not 2019, like 2017, 2018. Mm-hmm. Thereabouts. Now, now, two years, three years ago, Echo Room, Glitch and Co. are now doing it as independent um, yeah. organizations, production outfits. That is so easy for a bloody station to come up with. Because they can afford to, Mm -hmm. right? So the whole conversation about radio being dead is so daft. Let me tell you why. It's just changing, Um, evolving. Exactly. I'm also into advertising, right? And brand management, right? So tell me how radio is dead, but there's more money in saturation in terms of advertising. Every single year, every single year, traditional advertising gets more spend. Than social. Till today. Till today, the money's spent on... No, no, it's advertising in general. All the companies... All the products be wanting to... Exactly. The amount of money being spent on the radio still trumps what's being spent digitally. Check your facts. Till today. Radio creates awareness, right? It might not necessarily convert, but everybody's going to know about the thing. Do you understand? So at least you know about it. You know that there's a new milk that is coming out and it's 50 naira. Will you buy it? That's up to that's up to the that's other sort of like marketing on ground, but you would know that it is there, and that's what it is. And for music, and 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 it's for artists to engage with radio in a different way to their advantage. And it's what I mean at the beat I try to do. Yeah. You know, is to create even creative marketing campaigns for artists. So we did the Lungu FM for Ashake. And it's, there, it's no surprise that Ashake's first day numbers were fantastic because for one whole day, 24 hours, we changed the beat FM from beat 99.9 FM to Lungu FM. And I'm talking in terms of sweepers, in terms of branding, in terms of music, in terms of stickers, in terms of everything. We were doing giveaways every single hour. We gave over a million naira out. Wow. And it was all Ashake day on album release day. That was radio. People were calling in, we were sending videos of them listening to the album. And, and we did a whole album listening on radio as well. So for 24 hours, it was for Asha I mean, it that is, is one of the most brilliant things. And not Thank just you. the album, right? Maybe his <clears throat> entire discography. His discography, interviews from him, him calling in to talk to us as well. Oh, he did you that. Know, yes, we did that for a whole hour. And he told us how this was done. So that's a very interesting way of engaging and cluing, and cluing into your audience. For Nas Boy, we did something where we sort of did like this leak where they were talking about um, me and OC and yeah. saying they were bringing yeah. an o- a new yeah. OAP out. Yeah. We then did an announcement that we've hired Nas Boy as our, our new OAP. And then he took over the drive time show for the day. He had his friends in, his record label people, producers in. He played the music as well, told us why. And the people were calling, engaging, and listening to the music. And that directly translates because people are streaming your music right there and then. And you can see at this particular time. That's still radio and that's getting... You can't do that to reach over a million people at once just like that. And I think that people also underestimate the numbers for radio. Yeah. So for if you if you've ever worked at a radio station, there's something called MPS Mm -hmm. where they send like numbers and ratings for every radio station every month. Radio be doing over one million, over two million every month. Casually. Yeah, a station. Yeah. So imagine if your your music is playing across say 10, 15 stations 
you know how many people are tuned in and listening yes, for the time? top 10. Yes, uh, absolutely. It's, it's ridiculous. So, yeah. yeah, shout out to you for giving us more direction on that conversation around radio being, um, you know, not important. But do you think that radio itself can evolve and do better things? Of course. It's, you know... Do you think we're getting too stuck in that tradition now? I mean, I think we're trying to break out of it, but we can only do as much as we can do. It's a lie, you. We can only do as much as we can do because at the end of the day, some things need resources. There are so many What type of resource? No, money, please, speak money. to me. No, money. I'm, I'm talking. Listening. I'm talking like station by station. This is, I mean, at the end of the day, radio is per station. Okay. So, uh, so each station. How much money is is required for what? For the things that you say you can do some, because I, of I resources. I cannot be telling you my ideas on here. Ain't nobody pay me. Well, yeah, <laughs> but how I, much money? But at least I figures. know there are things that I want to do that, so like that will revolutionize things. I just don't give us money. Like, like how much? Like fifty million. Possibly. Yeah. And uh, are you telling me that your station does not have 50 Thank million. you very yeah. much. Was, your station does not have 50 million. Uh, my station has more than 50 million. Exactly. We're balling. However, there's there's priorities. several. Yeah, there are priorities. There's several stations in the company. There's yeah. Lagos Talks. There's, when your and idea, then we have stations in London. We're the only one that has a station Timmy, in London. Timmy, but yeah. once your idea is implemented, yes. would it yes, yield we'll get the financial money. It's not results. that it's not going to happen, but it's not going to happen like this. Like this. It's a work in progress. Bruv. But you but know, I, when I'm involved, there's going to be revolutionary things. I've always oh, no, done revolutionary I, yes, things. Yes, and that's you have. Shout out At to the you. first radio wedding ever, I, I, I mean, hello. So Purr. when it comes to period, creating exciting things for radio, I've yeah. always been able to do that in programming. Even yeah. say my name that a lot of people are copying now where they find your uh, spouse cheating. They're doing it on Twitter. They're doing it something that I used to do and made popular. So I've always played with programming and... You know, she, she did, did it as well. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there you go. But you see... No. Melody, you bloody Melody did it. Like, you, yeah, yeah, that's Melody, it. did you not like want to catch a dude see. on a birthday Queasy. shout-out thing? It's not something like she was Timmy. doing all the time. Timmy. It wasn't Timmy. a program. She caught many one. people. Yeah. Let me explain. Quisi is a Based bloody on liar. Birthday. Mm -hmm. He's a liar and a stinking... <laughs> he's a liar and, and a stinking <laughs> bitch. <laughs> I never. Now when you catch Melody, I never stammer. did anything <laughs> called say my name. I not did, say my name, sure. obviously. I did. I had a segment mm -hmm. for birthdays. Yeah. Okay. Call in. And did you catch niggas cheat? Wait, call in Every, and celebrate boy, your lover. Call in and celebrate your best friend or your friend on their birthday or wedding anniversary or new car or new house. Had nothing to do with cheating. But there was a twist of if your partner, if you're calling me, if you send me a message saying. I want you to call my partner on his birthday, on her or on her birthday to say happy birthday. What spin did you put to the, it? The spin would be when I call your partner, I'm gonna ask your partner what's your partner's name. Mm -hmm. oh, um, that's say my, my name. name. No. Oh, so it's what? Yeah, say my name. So it's what? No, they oh, wow. need to hear you. Okay, so wait. Okay, I so Melody, I go I off this week for your but again, again, I wait wait to, to the point. To the point. Yes. point. You know, yeah, um, radio is fun. Radio is exciting. Radio, radio is great. Is, radio is great. Radio is great. Radio is cool. The, 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 so, I don't know where you guys would lay on this side of the conversation, okay, but I go. think that the biggest problem to radio are the owners. Okay. Yes. The owners do not, or a lot of owners, lots of owners have refused to see beyond their nose. They mask it with the conversation of being businessmen but that's absolute garbage, right? A lot of radio presenters, staff members have amazing ideas that would change the system, but they've chosen to stay straight-jacketed as they were 40 billion years ago since they started listening to radio and think that's what it is, to the point where you have very creative individuals that have top ratings at their time belt spanning for nine months and you shit on them because they are delivering. Honestly speaking, that's all I see. Because also you say, oh, nah, that's not my style. That's not the style I envisioned for the station. But now this person, they use in wit and creativity and humor and intelligence to change the system, right? A break from the norm of all of them the way they use fake accent. Although now the babe, they travel past. <laughs> right. I was, I was to ask All of the wait, huh? I was to ask her about the accents, but yes. Oh, we are going there, right? So you have all of these things, and then you shit on this OAP because 
Baba Nashi get the highest ratings for that bloody station for eons, right? It's just stupidity. And the owner did the look until the babe come up for the station. I, I didn't. Now that they struggle, they say they want to put Gen Z for there. Then Gen Z call the own radio, they talk dragons. You need to hear this, this station. <laughs> Lord, crazy. They, but Thank you. Let me I just tell you, say, make I just tell you, say, this particular station, why they talk. I have a lot of friends in this station. I love my friends. But this particular <laughs> station, why they tell you, but <laughs> now three numbers did it. Okay. <laughs> now three numbers did it. Anyways, but. What is that? <laughs> he's not okay, but I do. Yeah, whatever. I just say, make I just talk that way. You don't say what I want to talk. Speaking about remember. speaking about Ashake, right? Yeah, he Ashak. won, Ashak. Okay. He won next boy. rated at the last yeah. headies. And of course, people have been having conversation around <laughs> this year's <laughs> headies and talking about the quality of artists that we've had this year. We are in the month of October. We do we don't have a hit song. Hmm. We have we have we have what was songs. our hit song last year? We what we say was the hit song last we year. We had quite there a was number. No D. There was no we D. We had the... Okay, let's say top five. Quite a lot. Top quite five. A lot. I don't remember top five. I won't even lie. But so I, I remember... Off artists. the top of your head. Everything Ashake dropped. Yeah, okay, but Ashake, Ashake. 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 Don't cast. So that was Ashake. Okay, so this year, you're saying there is no clear hit song or no clear hit artist. No, hit song. Song. New hit, new hit song at all. There's song now. There's song. song. I would like Ashake's songs for, for one. No, no, no. Oh, then I'm we, active. We know, we know that yeah. you painted your station. Boom. 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 You boom. painted your station, Ashake, but boom. that's my hit song. Let me do it, Bell. Let me do it, Bell. Do you show Can you compare this one now? It's the woof woof for me. Um, um, Kalazama, Kalazam, and any and Rema or Zeba or Zeba. Don't worry, Rema's album. Rema's album. So Rema is giving. Where, where's my guy? Where did he go? Yeah, Where did he travel that's, to? That's, that's my a, guy. That's yeah. a close hit, but it's not like a hit hit. Come Even on. Ogechi. Okay, it's a lower, it's a lower. It's a smash record. Ogechi is a smash record. Yeah. Banma. Um, I don't know what they said there. What about? Is it Kanma or Banma? Mama took a photo, back up his lip. I don't know, but is that one that's no Juju, yeah, it's coming. Out. It's gonna be it's gonna by December it's gonna be penetrated if it's not okay. already. Okay. okay but so, this year the struggle shall make her no so lie. Who is the popping like you know last year we had like popping emerging artists that came and you know shut things down? This year it's bad boy be OML. Ioma not TML vibe, but he doesn't even have TML, like sorry. TML. <laughs> I say OML. We don't have There's that. bad boy OML. Oh, yeah. But it's the one, is it not? The, it's all right, actually. Yeah. They are, they're all good. Yeah. They're all getting the bad boys. But I am off, I am off, I am off. It's I am uh, King Maddie, this year, who oh, no, Okay. So Last the year, problem with I this conversation off. is this every time people put King Madi in this, Thanks. King Madi never do two years. Mm -hmm. but, but we're speaking about next week. Naima, they tell yeah, you yeah, now, yeah, King Madi never do two years. Yeah, 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 yeah. So why us? I don't know. Should she be a next rated? So where should she be? With the other guys. What's that other? Li what's that other list now? Which um, one? Oh no, no, no. I think next, next rate. Actually, next rated is the one. Be, that, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's the other one that's best new artist or something like that. Yeah. 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 So you know, TML Taves. I don't know about Taves, man. I love Taves. We, I, the exactly. buzz yeah. is, I don't think the yeah. buzz is there. Everything is there. The music is good, but, but. contender. So I'll say Ayomaf. Ayomaf is mine. Ayomaf is the guy, Ayomaf. to be honest. But let's be very honest, right? Melody, Fido has before the you one even song, mention so. there, who? Mm, Fido. 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 Uh, uh, I will love. Yeah. <laughs> you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why won't you people like it? No problem. But well, I like no. the song. I like the song. I love the song. Um, it's a good song. So this okay. is this is where the problem is. Uh -huh. I caught on to I will lower pretty late. Mm -hmm. Right? But I can't talk to all the songs. Everyone the raved about it. Everyone yeah. around me raved about mm -hmm. it. Right. And then I went to check it out. Yeah. And that's what brought my attention to this conversation. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Saying this to say that's a dope record. Mm -hmm. But it's, the one song. it's really not as dope as you would imagine. So mm -hmm. maybe because, I don't know, maybe because I was expecting a whole lot more, right? I was expecting, for the record, I was expecting when Mayoku going to the game, when Ashake going to, no, no Ashake, but yeah, Ashake is respected. Mm -hmm. um, when Mayoku going to the game, when uh, who else, someone like Wande Cole broke into the game because that's how the Gen Z and 
Gen Alpha. I've been raving about it around my vicinity. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Only to listen to it, it was not particularly underwhelming. Mm -hmm. I love the record still, but it just no meets the Standard. But I think Way I think because you, you have a it's it's the tempo of the day it's so what is important per time is different I think when yes. when they call came out it was the sound there was different. club culture everybody was like in yeah. the clubs you bad you mm -hmm. want it you mm -hmm. bad you mm -hmm. want it so then everybody was. Everybody was happy, guys. Yeah. yeah. Can we realize Juan that? Nicole did not every... come out with you bad first. No, I'm just saying he that was a popular. A that, that was the. He came out with a song that was way slower. Which is Ololufe. Thank you very yes, much. Yes, but so that, well, that's the not the one they call the, song. For the, for for the, that's, that's not the one they call song. Are you no. okay? You say what? That's not that's the one they call song. That was one they call song. Because there was an upward projection. He of had a lot career. of he had a lot of music that, around that time that wasn't the only no other song. Records, if he had no other records and he was like, after so can we ask songs, regular people what they remember when they call for? It's not so Lulu fair. Like because the they were bigger head. records. That was my the proper point. No, even to at the, the but time, that's her point. even Literally. at the time, there was it was not. But she, I, I cannot people disagree. Your yeah, melody, behave yourself. It's it's like it's like Primer had Oleku and there was. The good morning, Omoge, baby, me, how you exactly. do? Yes. That was the iconic Brymos, but it wasn't the reason why you fucked with Brymos, let's be for real. Like, it was Oleku, it was the party songs. And I think that's what people expected that of Brymos. Then the first album came out, and they're like, oh, yeah, this is really not they what we saw. Exactly. So that's it. I think now everybody is really fucking sad, guys. I agree. Like everybody's sad, so what's, that's what's why this song. Driving? That's why this song <laughs> is important it. to this generation. Yes, like that's yeah. why it's such a big deal. But that's their reality. Be it's their reality. Yeah. There's no sadness in that song. So do you know the what the song is that about? Song, the theme of that song is is smoky ego. Yeah, but why are you doing that? If you're, not, if you're happy, Fabulous. are you going to wake up in the morning and just be a I'm sorry, sorry. Is there what? What? Uh, Wait, 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 wait. You say what? Are you going to wake up in the morning and do what? I just be five going. Hey, you'll be surprised. A lot no. of people's lifestyles. But she's not asking you if you're happy. Would no, you you're happy. happy. That's not your go to. Happy. Like, you're going to do happy shit. Do you know how much it costs to smoke weed for these niggas? But does not like if you were happy. Baba? It costs. Nah, lie, you it, want fuck going, yeah, man? See, wait, why are you fuck going? That's what? the question. Yes, why are you my point is, is it is, it okay. is very wrong for you to assume that the niggas that smoke it will smoke it because they are sad. At 8 a.m. Okay. Then they launch the day. Because of <laughs> Give what? this day our daily bread. But not their daily bread. Of what? Why? They'll be like, I'm not more stressed it, today. I mean, make I just day okay. okay. Make I just slide yes, up. Make I day okay. Make I face out. the day. Uh, make I face the day. It's ginger. The people it's I know like that smoke Igbo don't dead. smoke because they have a tough time. Trust me, you're not talking to them well enough. Wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Yeah, no, they will tell you when I want to forget. When I just want to. No, I don't. I don't even smoke weed. Okay. So. But that is why, because you don't do it because you don't have issue. By the time you your issue, issue, your issue will cook to an extent. You'll just be like, issue. hello, I'm ah, blind, I dog. I'm in <laughs> hey, what, What's that whiskey? This thing? What's that whiskey? Uh, okay, you know, he Farouk. doesn't, he drinks. There's Farouk. always something. Farouk. Like, okay. in Lagos, you need something to deal with Lagos. What's you your advice? Be, my advice, I watch TV, a lot of TV. Interesting. Of yeah. Obviously. I watch a lot of TV. I, I drink how, a lot is that, of how is that advice? And then I, well, it's a vice because, like, why? I think this time I visit to watch TV, I can do other things with my life. Um, I what else? I'm, I'm always like cooking, <laughs> cooking Ooh, always fancy hey, things. What are you cooking? I'm always cooking fancy oh, she things. Cooks. She cooks. Yeah, I cook everything. Quite a lot. Uh, yeah, especially that's when I'm, I'm sad, I just start cooking. Okay. okay, that's fine. Yeah. Please, so, I'm not asking. Those but, are my vices. No, no, I'm very, I did try, just let them know. That. So you have a line shop, one of those things. I don't care. For Nobody does. She's just trying to oh, sell you. Oh, wow. <laughs> I love you. Lovely. Oh, baby. But in other oh news, um, still speaking about Afrobeat and music, Afrobeat, some Afrobeat artists, you know, the Afrobeat space and Afrobeat legends, they be having meltdowns on social media. Yeah. And I knew we were going to talk about this Meltdown. Thing. Is yeah. That's not even meltdown. But, but he's just having a good time. I think he's just having a good Sorry? time. Sorry? 
I think he's having a good time. I do. You know, do you know the kind of flex it is? Where it's just sit down and know that if you tweet one thing, everybody's just gonna scatter. No. Just for the fun of you, like. Well, that, <laughs> I bet he was just at home, <laughs> loving the time of his life. But, that, but that's a major part. That, and because it's a part that exists. You think, but but that's you know, like ha ha ha. Let me do it, and he would tell you like, ah, they're coming to collect the phone for me. But before they come, let me just ha ha. Hi, fuck you, they fuck you, fuck you, fuck just you. Having ha, a good time. Nice, and then before you know, all the blog is burner boy. Said. <laughs> It's just if I was, I would be doing it all the time just to mess with people. I don't know, full stop. What does this full stop mean? Imagine if Beyonce oh, just... type full stop now. Oh hey! my god, the theory of oh one my one. god, did 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 this. She oh knows my... it's the end. The babe, it might have been a typo. Do you know what I mean? It might have been a typo. But, but to be a celebrity, blue could have been wild. with the phone, it could have been anything. So let's just come. See these people; they have pounds telling. No, not only do they have pounds telling, they have private jets, they, they have, have children, family. they are both in love, they have any designers they feel like. We will be here saying AFC. Shut up your mouth, go and us too, please. Take oh my God! I say, please. I need even you give me pounds telling. Whiskey though, for me no. David do for me no. So what's my business? <laughs> oh my God! Did you did? Viewers, did you have money? Lower. No. So can we focus on how we win? There is the national convention. How did we want to get the money for our life? Because egg is expensive. Actually, egg is expensive. <laughs> and, and, and I think that this is like a word to like the fans. Yeah. I think it's ridiculous how it's much. Just... Not ridiculous in a bad way, but ridiculous mm -mm. in a funny way. How much they are, these people, like their fans, they go in. Like yeah. they just be going. Please, Melody, when you finish, me, I want to say something about the whiskey. Oh yeah, please say. Because well, Timmy is that, coming here to. Yeah, I me, can me, see. No, me, Timmy, anything actually. Okay, good. Right, okay. you know, man's is man's is super calm, okay. chill. Okay. So, bro, Oga. Which of the Oga? You see that thing that Timmy just talk? Yeah. <laughs> it's not right. <laughs> Are you there? Why I'm you not. I make no talk. I want. I love Timmy, bro. It's not. It's not right. When someone look, he underst he understands his power. Mm -hmm. There's yes. no way he's not aware. Mm -hmm. Of course. I mean, why do you think Suya is hungry me or something about Suya? And you know, it's mm -hmm. everywhere. He knows. He just right? prepared. Two days ago, Abi. When how many days ago? That is not him being the whiskey that is treating Suya. That is ex full expression of himself. Mm -hmm. As far as I'm concerned, yeah, mm -hmm. nobody yeah, that's not who was he is. Absolute garbage. Whiskey has always been. I'm, this no person, offense, I'm though. not insulting. He, I'm not. No, no. From back in the no. day, Wiz, Wiz used to be on Twitter Baba, a lot. Baba, look, a see, lot. Wiz has always been one of the reasons why a lot of people love him, mm -hmm. right? Especially with his tweets, mm -hmm. is how he does it, right? Mm -hmm. He's pointing at you without entirely pointing at you. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. But yesterday it was, was, it was, it was up, up way front. too much. He put a dent to his brand, put a dent to his name. Now, I always, for branding, Maybe not hold, dent on, to his brand, hold on, hold well, on. Baba, 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 please let me say something. Look, Wiz is the closest to Jay Z and Beyonce type branding. In Nigeria. Yes, in Nigeria. I agree. Mm -hmm. Wiz, or rather, was the closest. You see, wait, that he is Baba. I don't. I don't think like so. Like some tweets, like this Hold man on. just lost did, his mommy. Did we read the tweets? Like he just lost his mommy. Guys. Timmy, what does that have to do with anything? So like everything. No, it, it has, it a lot has to do with everything. That's to do. where I was when going you to lose, land. When you lose the only, like you know, sometimes like. Your brother, people will say like, like when you get to that point where you lose something that is extremely important to you, like the thing that maybe was your anchor mm -hmm. and that is not there anymore. The realization of grief is a really messed up thing. Yes. I'm not yes, excusing the behavior, no, an excusing but thing. it makes sense. Like Kanye lost his mom and did worse, my G. Not, like yes. we he's still, ha he still from hasn't him. recovered from that. I'm not excusing it, but like it makes sense. Like he may, so, and this is not for lack of provocation. There, there's been a lot of like hidden silent jabs here and there. Yeah, and he, I guess he was just like he smoked something or whatever. He was just like whatever, man. I think Farouk, it's, it's out Farouk of character. Like work. you know. This is somebody it that is we know. Very right? out of character. So, That's so like, I'm, like, I'm where is land. our compassion as human beings? Like, 
like just everybody chill like so chill this is someone that's obviously going the first single he released as a feature he talked about his mom like guys calm down i want can we just calm I down and understand what is happening yes. like POV. use some yes. emotional intelligence to gauge beneath, POV. beneath the surface um, of things look, so i, I was going to land on that I agree. Mm-hmm. right um Olamide did go through this phase as well. Yeah. Right. And he even put it in the song. No, but was he on social media? No, he was not typing. Okay. Yeah. His was more appearance. Acting now. Yeah, yeah. Acting now at... type of stuff is, is, is grief. That's I what I was going to learn to say. Nobody is seeing the end or rather the starting point of this thing. And the starting point is, is his mom. Right. He put it. He has always spoken about his mom from the beginning of his career. Yeah, he has right. mommy, me, mommy, mommy, me. Like mommy has been. Do you get what I mean? So, I totally get that. Mm-hmm. But that should never happen. Yeah, but he's so, a so human being. The, the, the part where okay. I was even asking Timmy, be like, okay, so when she said like the, his mom, he, him losing his mom, sadly, and I was like, what does that have to do with this? The reason I said that was it's because I even think that away from that, away from. I know that obviously Biscuit is very, very particular about his mom. He really loves his mom. And I know that for sure he's still grieving that entire situation. But I think that for this particular thing that happened on social media, I don't, I, I see the connection, but I also think that there might be something that we don't know about that happened behind the scene. Behind the scenes? Yes, maybe him and like the artist or maybe the. Which artist? He was talking about David Doe now. Yeah, that's what I, I don't mean. understand. Like maybe he yeah, might, it, the it artist. could have. It could have, but maybe the something happened. To, because it's not the first time something. So maybe something has been happened. going on that we're not even privy but to. But the reaction to like it what? in the moment, it, it, it was just very unlikely. But story. why are we making excuses for this situation? I literally just said I'm not making excuses, but I'm just trying to explain. After making excuses. I'm not making an excuse, I'm explaining a behavior. Okay, well, yeah. You're that right. is unusual. Yeah, um, because this is not a. This is not. This, not, this is not track. Are yeah, we going exactly. to. Are we going to try. Well, I mean, not him taking accountability, but are we going to bestow accountability on this fellow? <laughs> At least we just said what he know. did wasn't the best yes, thing to do, bro. but I can so understand please, I mean, it. Can we even speak about David Doe? What about him? <laughs> what is, is that? Why him? is David Doe facing all of these things? Man's is just because I think a lot of life. this is also man made. I think when people the energy around them is so toxic, they're being pit against each other all Fan the them. time. Always I don't know why fans. Nigerians do that. Even now, Fino's album is out. They are doing Fino versus Salami. They, what is and this? those are guys. And I'm like, why? And Can't people responded. just be people? So I don't think that helps. So when you... This person might not have seen something. Somebody will come and say, did you see the way uh, the video did his eye on this picture when he was holding whiskey and I it promise. means that he's a devilish person? I do you promise. know? And you know, these people see everything. We think they don't, but like, yeah, they're Every, on their phones. They're seeing everything. They're, but they're phones not, seeing everything. Every, There's no how you don't internalize some of that stuff and start yes. beefing each other. If you look at it, you'll be like, sorry, why do I know even like this person? You might not even know. I but swear. it's the energy. The energy around them is so toxic. We do this with everybody. There was Tiba Savage and Shay Shay till something happened. I really feel like it's just bad, bad energy. Bad energy. Just bad energy, just bringing things where they just don't. We can be together now. When this interview come out or this section come out, they'll say, can you see the way Quincy is looking at her? When she said that's the biggest uh, interview, <laughs> the eye was this, the high was. I mean, so I'll be looking at it like, ha! Ah. It's true. You feel like Quincy like, really looked me like that. You will ugly. I'll be like, get out. That, Actually, you know, no, baby, I love you so still. I just think it's just everybody chill. We're all so. going to die. I'm sure going to highlight. I mean? I'm sure going to highlight. We're all going to this? die. Why? What is this? And there's, and the, when, you're you're dead, when you're dead, when you're dead, and you get to heaven, they will now with the whiskey door. They do. You will be facing that was, is that what heaven or hell. You know when Jay Gabriel will ask you at the, at the gates, like, you'll be facing heaven or hell. So, whiskey fan, come here. Did you understand? Do fan, nobody knows that one. What will the prophet say, man? In heaven, just hallelujah. Every time he wants to fight, it's just zaps. Look at your surrounding. Have you seen? Look at your just for, for before you tweet. Look at your surrounding. Come on, come on. Should I really be you saying this? Right? Go to whiskey pen. Look at his own surrounding. Do you understand? Oh, he's not mm. the same surrounding. Mm. It couldn't so be. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, he should also on my door. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because everybody just calm down. Life is not. I'm just going to highlight how David did not respond to her. 
he, 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 I mean, he don't I don't think no, that no, he no, didn't no, want to respond. I just love how he. I don't. I don't see, think he didn't bro, want see. to respond. I think what had happened is he probably seen that people are like, ah, I like the way the guys didn't respond. He's like, yeah, thank God. That's <laughs> a lie, bro. Don't even no. Please no. Like, no. You know, you usually he no. would. Because you know, David no. would not respond. Normally he would. Yeah. But he looked at it and said, Nah, I'm bigger than this. This is too low. Sure, bro. That's cool. big Dave. Fair. I mean, he says big congratulations. Dave. <laughs> Big David, <laughs> 001 for a reason. Oh, My okay. man, I love Obvious him. You yeah, just declare yourself as the Obio fans, have you? He said, you, say, yeah, you, you are not sounding like the Twitter people. No, but uh, you are the one that said, say, My no, God, I'm, I'm, ho, ho, I, I one, love, the most magnificent. No, no, you are no, the one that said I'm it sorry, oh. So I want to ask, can't you say it with your chest? That I'm, oh, I'm yeah, David Doe. Yes. I'm Tati BG, David Do Yes, Tati BG. At now. With my food chest. At DMW slash Tati BG. Your age, your grandad. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yes, I love David with all my heart. I love two boats. I love two boats. I love whiskey too. Whiskey, this is my cousin. Whiskey too. David, David for do life. is like David. Please, you have no help me. please, where is the camera? Hello, everybody, you have help. It's What's that about? Help you are looking for. Ah, go. Are you have to sit for help and you will help me. Go and meet whiskey. Is there whiskey? Are you? He will help you. I see a parawa from times now. Yeah. <laughs> oh come on. From way back when I was Big based David. in London, you know, I was based in abroad. We yes. used to ah, we have title. <laughs> so David, I want to get Hola, to know you more. I want to get better. to know. He's busy. Let's He's busy. He's busy. Busy Hola, for me. Jogel. He's busy. Well, Only little things. Hola, Don't take care of. <laughs> to be fair, I'm really looking forward to the Mariah album. I want to hear me it. Me too. I think it'll be fantastic. At this point, I really want to hear. I it. think I, I had know. always said when he was in Lagos in that whole period that I look. I'm looking forward to hearing the kind of music that comes from this experience. I think this one is going to be a classic album because he has something to say now. I think the other albums he wow just wow. The, they're, they're, wow. they're good musically. It, what? No, but he does have something to say now. He's been through stuff. A lot Did of he have stuff. something to say before? No, That's this what is my real. question is. This is, this is pain. So, you know, pain births fantastic stuff. Happiness it's why Adele, Adele is so good. It's why yeah. Summer Walker dates men for free just to give us fantastic music. Listen to Taylor, Taylor Swift. About Taylor Swift. Jenny Aiko. Taylor Swift. You know, why people do their thing, you know, but like, I know Black Summer Walker is like, she's deep and Girl, stuff. she's. So I'm I, just I, like, can, I can. And then he's grown. Pain also births growth. I you know. Agree. When you go through pain, you go through something to come out better on the other end. Mm. And I cannot imagine what lessons he's learned. You know, he's also expecting another child right after his mom died. Is he going to be a girl? What are his thoughts about that? He spent some time connecting, going back to the hood. He's talking about how his dad does this, you know, going, going around. So I expect to hear some of that. More stories. When was this music. empathy for Dave? I'm not, I'm sorry, I'm not. I I'm not speaking to, speak to you about now. About and about that at the time. We're talking about this at the no, time. No, but this I'm just randomly this. saying. Where was this empathy that, for David Doe when? in general? But we were at, not um, on this at point of interview. timeless. At point of timeless losing. The empathy person, was everywhere. That, everybody uh -huh. empathized with everybody. Him. That did not last two days. That's a big lie. Are you a joker? Next thing, see, are you, you start bashing you text him. your WhatsApp no. group and just tell them that everything no, is okay? No, you're actually now what, you're what, embarrassing. What, what, text your WhatsApp group that everything wow. is really embarrassing. Because so. wow. David Doe wow. literally had empathy. Really talking People points. were empathizing with, with David Till for today, the longest time. Till today, they're still empathizing with him. Yes. So what are they talking about? And the next thing, they start bashing him. We? Was it us? I don't. I didn't say it's. We're on an now. interview. Said, We're on a thing. Oh my god! Am I for lunch? Let me cut this. Person, <laughs> this like men, this is just like men to go off points. Of the wow. point. Am I for lunch? It's just like men. Of the point. You are this because what, what are we talking self. about? You see where the problem is in life. You see where the problem is in life. Wait, wait, wait. You see where the problem is in life. You see where the problem is in life. Madam, madam. You see where the problem is in life. What concern men with this thing now? Because you are a man disgracing yourself and your gender. <laughs> ah. Sorry, man. But no, this but guy is not part of. Give me to expel you from your side. I retain my point of. 
he didn't get as much as the empathy ah, that you're oh displaying God. right now. No, this is and a this is a truth. very dark line stop. of conversation. I'm so sorry. I feel, I, I don't like the fact that you use that word because it's me, factual. Okay. This is factual okay. that is daft. All right, because lovely. till now. People still empathizing with him. I've not, seen, I've not seen one person who has not Quincy. Do you understand? I think you are pushing agenda. What are you on about? I'm you not are, pushing any agenda. It's you okay. It's, okay. it's all over please, Twitter. It's okay, please. It's, it's all over Twitter. Time. You're home. It's okay. Uh, sorry, X. It's all ah. over X. Um, Obio, but I'm Quincy. No, wow. Quincy like more, more, more. Okay, my Barai. More, more. No. Okay, all right. He, he fine. He does him on a problem. All right. Problem okay, that. fine. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. Congratulations to you and everybody. Thank you. It all means right. a lot. <laughs> anyway, so what um, what song do you have on replay on radio right now at your radio station? Ooh, this is tough. There's so many. Which one stands out for you? And why? <sighs> Ha. This is very interesting mm -hmm. because it's on my radio station. It is. You should so know. It's specific to my radio yeah. station. Yeah. Not what me personally am on repeat. So. No, not you. No. Okay. Thanks for the question. I would say, uh, I will love a feed up. Okay. Alone, Fala and Bad Boy OML. We have that. We have Are You There? Are You Math? Ashake. Fuji vibe, that is a jam. Um, we have Rukmani Escapade. That's really good. It's a nice R&B number. Should I keep on going? Okay, that's fine. <laughs> what, song, what song do you have on your playlist on replay? Personally. If, nah, my playlist is very weird. Oh, I've been stuck on um, Caveman and... Uh, Caveman and SDC recently. Children come, no love in Lagos, mm. the or just the whole work. project, mm. the okay. whole project mm -hmm. on repeat. Um, oh yeah, I've been doing a lot of Manuel's Wells as well. I've always loved mm. him, yeah. but it's just a, almost every song is fantastic. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. I'm, I don't know why he's he's getting the recognition, but I feel like it could he deserves be a more. Lot more. Manuel definitely deserves more, but that's his combination of his bald head. Lot more. He needs to get Bro, more. Yes. And his videos are super creative. The promotion for his songs, even though it keeps combing his body. Means is what I'm listening to on my own, though. Personally? Personally. Means. Why do you like Means? Um, Means says things I want men to say to me. That's why I like Means. Yeah. Wow. Not yeah. men, a man or the man. Like, that's fair. Yeah. That's, that's absolutely fair. So now... It says interesting things. When what is the most profound thing you've heard from me that you're like, oof? Um, there's there are two songs on the new album. There's F U and Low. I think mm -hmm. that those are really good musically. They musically sound like the production mm -hmm. is very good. The feature the project is on one of them, mm -hmm. and I just think the blend is just it flows. It's music that you listen to. You just find yourself on the beach. On the beach. Yeah, you just think of yourself there. And you're just like, yeah, naked. No. Okay, you're wearing a bikini. Okay, cool. That's cool. cute. Cutesy. Cool. You have Prosecco. Okay, cool. And you're dancing. Just, yeah. Yeah. All right. Just, exactly. All right. All right. So on the Afrobeat conversation, Malik Barry was having a conversation and he said that he thinks that, you know, um, he feels Afrobeat could have been more protected. Speaking about like the genre and the need for like gatekeeping of the genre. And, you know, as Nigerians, when it comes to Afrobeat and him thinking that we could have done more to gatekeep. And he said also said that gatekeeping is not a bad thing. That he feels like for the genre, we can do more to keep it or protect it. What do you think, Quincy? It's, it's just bullshit. I'm tired of this conversation about gatekeeping something. This is music. Everyone would always take um, whatever they feel sounds right, especially for a country like Nigeria, where we're bursting with creativity at every doorstep. If we find something that sounds nice, we're trying to recreate that or mm -hmm. readjust it to our entire environment, mm -hmm. right? Or reproject it or however it is. Mm -hmm. There's no such thing as gatekeeping. How about the US gatekeep hip hop? How about that? How about um, what's it called? Gatekeep salsa and everybody keeps gatekeeping their, their sound. Then what happens to the sound? The reason for the level of um, adaptation of the sound by other nations or other people is because it sounds good and they would like to make stuff 
right? And that has also contributed to the success of the music, right? This gatekeeping conversation is just, it doesn't make any sense. They keep saying it. Hip hop, what if hip hop was gate kept? But then again, I don't know in what context, because context is very important. Like, yeah. what does he mean by gatekeeping? Like protecting the sound. <clears throat> uh, because, um, yes, hip hop wasn't, but again, it's Nigerian hip hop. It's not like they act, they would just accept Eobliss on like like radio, like US radio, and it will be playing like widely popular. Um, so the barrier to entry. But we're wasn't, fighting for that to happen. Yes, but the we barrier for to that entry to is being gate. I think they are gatekeeping it. Like a abroad. random person cannot just come. You and can't be just like number one. But New I York. think Nigeria were very accepting of everybody and everything. I think we're too selfish a people to even allow any form of gatekeeping of anything. I think once money is involved, it's just like how much is it? Let's go. We are ready to go. Um, but I I don't know what he means. I don't know if he meant. You know, everybody takes people out of context. I don't know if that's what he meant. Gatekeeping the sound in what way? Because it's creative expression. You can't really... What are we supposed to do? Mm -hmm. But I get what he means in terms of disrespect. Because Tyler is... Like, that Tyler whole thing was just unnecessary. It was... It was a whole... Which of them? Exactly. <laughs> the, the MTV one the where awards. she won... Where she, said she's not. And she said she's not Afrobeat, she's I'm a piano. I think that... that she didn't just even a, say that. Did she not? She, she didn't did. say I. She, she didn't say I shouldn't have collected this award. Literally, that, that wasn't what she said. I think we took her at. No, concert. she didn't say that, but she we, clearly no. said. She said, that, I'm, an, I'm, a, "I'm from South Africa. I'm, I'm an, I'm, I, I represent. I'm a piano. Like, I'm yes. Not, she said, I am. She not didn't say Afro I'm not an Afrobeat dancer. She said okay, that. maybe we need to run it back. But I think um, she did say that. I don't remember 100, but I'm find that. she said something like that. Yeah. I don't know about the part of not being Afrobeat. Like she, she said, said she's not Afrobeat. You know, we're a box, like it, it crazy yeah, she the way. But we're a box. She explained but, that the world, but, Africa is beyond Afrobeat. Yes, but she then said, what was the point of her saying she's on a piano? Because she's a South African and she's promoting no, there was, her there country was on She stage. should have not Sorry, even but accepted the, song, but the nomination really for good? award in best Afrobeat category. Thank you. The song is not an Amapiano song. It's not an Amapiano song. My point exactly. So like, was in the right If she was going to collect it, she should have just said, thank you. I moved on. What was, oh, I'm this, 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 we're boxed up in the press. I'm right? If you were going to do that <laughs> speech, you should have never accepted the award nomination in the first place. I don't agree. Because that is the speech you are, you are going to come and say, thanks for this. You box us in. I'm not really this, but thank you for this. Why? If you don't believe you are this person, if you don't believe you're an Afrobeat artist, why collect an award in the best Afrobeat category? You should have just mm -hmm. told them, how many people have boycotted awards? Jay-Z has boycotted award, this same uh, award. I mean, I don't believe in this thing. I'm not going to come, period. At, the, at inception, thanks for nomination, but Tyler is not an Afrobeat artist. Can you give it to another person? I don't think if Ashake had won the Grammy for the song I'm a Piano, he would have come and said, thank you very I'm much. I'm not a Piano, I'm, I'm a Afrobeat. I'm I'm Afrobeat. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, <laughs> you know, thank, and he would have gone. So she Sad, was trying to, like, what was the point of that? I there don't understand. No there was no, there point, was no point. Like, it didn't need to be. She Absolutely said, thank no you. Point. So she didn't even win our She could have even said Afrobeat the artist. same. The song won an award. Best, Afro best Afrobeat. So again, my Anybody point can is, be an Afrobeat artist is the my, point. Yes, we're not, Anybody, we're not disagreeing Afrobeat, with you. Yeah, you can do. No, we are not disagreeing with, with you. It's an Afrobeat song. Had said. But why did she go and say that? Because she was educating people about African sound. I think that was a profound thing. She could have said that without saying, without saying I'm, 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 I'm a piano. She could have said yes, we tend to box us in a kinetic. She said that. Thank you very much. That's okay. fine. So it is that she now said. So when you now say, oh, but I'm a piano. So why did you, why <laughs> yeah. you now come and collect the award? Because I'm a piano artist can win Afrobeat song. And then you should not have come. Afrobeat category. Imagine, and that's not imagine, a problem. Look at, it's, it's like, a problem to her. Do you understand? It's like giving me an award for best uh, male. I co come and collect the award. <laughs> I come on stage. I collect I say, the award. And I say, thank you. I'm female. You tend to bust mean. everybody up. <laughs> but it's a female. female. <laughs> and I still carry my own award and go. But if you know you are not taking it, you would have to. Sorry, please, I'm not sure you know in this category. Sorry, you don't, don't be angry. I, I, don't, I, I, I don't identify as that. Yeah, so, like, 
You just basically collected your own and said, yeah, I don't want to identify as this. Bye. What is that? I think that was an important stage to educate people. And no, educate it wasn't the right no. stage. You could have no, picked any not, other not, stage. And I think that it's what not. her speech was quite the better. She could quarters, have picked her grammy stage. Go. Any that. stage, she could, have picked, uh, she could have put her TikTok. Good evening. I collected the award. Oh. Thank you very much for actually... Ah, choo, 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 choo. Bro, Come they could have set up an entire choo, 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 choo. session on Breakfast Club for that. Listen, why you come and do that? I said, no problem. She will come and to come to my station. I'll say, sit down. What is really... Okay, you have a Yoruba boy. He broke your heart on that day, right? Open up to me, dear. Because why do that? Because why does? Why that? Do you understand? Me, 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 before she did, Sha. You're, you're what? I understand. And I think that it was an important stage to... Um, she did not talk about people, people dying in Africa. So is many it, issues. In Africa, they're always dying. So many, ah, yeah. they're not dying in America. I'm dying in Africa. Yeah, oh. every time Hello, I'm dying, I'm dying. in Africa. I, I agree I'm with you. Dying I agree with you. Place, every, every time. I'm a Toro woman. It's not even Toro in the world. 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 So the shopping go for me for Africa or what? It's not even Toro in the world. So, okay. There's so many things you could have said. And we're dying in America. We're dying in Africa. Cancer okay. sucks. So HIV is real. Poon. So many things. Oh, baby. Oh, no. So many things you could have said. HIV. Oh, if I said cancer, God. you did not hear the cancer one. Not the HIV okay. part. Ah, oh, my name is why you put cancer on the These are issues plaguing your civil in Lake Ah, You are going through it. Yeah, now don't you not see the news? Yes. No. They are going through this pandemic everywhere. Everywhere is Tell so me. diseased. Yeah. Tell me. Ah, ah. Tell me. I can't Bro, believe it. Other, there are other no, things no, than HIV. What do you mean by HIV? Like so if it's so one, there's no other songs. What, 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 what does she mean by like if it's one disease? Like, I don't know. Ah. Like, it's so disease. Like if it's one, I can't. Shout out to my mom. My mom shout out to her. I can't believe I'm saying this. But she just started like working out with a bunch of women. And she's just hearing all the things happening in Lekki. And she's so shocked. She just called me and said, that place is a heaven for <laughs> Is it what? <laughs> heaven for Because you cannot. She said that, how can you be a wedded individual living in Lekki? Because everything is on deck. You, imagine you want to go and buy meat pie. You will see. Ha gala gala. Ha gala gala. Oh, ah, ah. Come on. You have to fall into temptation. There's no way. You you just fall in. This ah, people are that based <laughs> on this place. You people, congratulations. <laughs> oh God, TBB, you are absolutely killing me. Ah. So I don't understand. When Tyler should go and say, say hello, we are dying in Africa. Okay, so he's not even dying what? in Africa. Oh, yeah, no about but there are other causes. <laughs> okay, there are things are should they all go for? They are fighting war. They are doing. We are the fighting war. Ah. We are always, we are always, we are always, we are always doing something. We are the fighting war. You don't see the Israelite, Israelite. Is <laughs> that? <laughs> Bro, I swear. Yes, if she issues. had said, if she had said, if she had said, we need the war to Everybody stop. Said, you know that better. We need the war. As a South African. No, no. Why not? She doesn't have to be South African. It touch everybody. Last Just last. everybody. Say, oh, we need world please. peace. Um, we need world, world peace. peace is I know that's not. You know they did what? Recycling. We need world Something peace. Something global warming. Something else. That, that would have sufficed. Do you understand? Not so. I'm, 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 they are yeah, no. killing the rhinos. No, no, no. They are dying. It's that was a day. That is you so, know why people they love that stuff? South Africa. You just say rhinos. Okay, 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 okay. Climate change. You just clap. Oh my God. No, no, this lady, no. she's so Save good. Save the plants. Exactly. Oh Let's not killing um, cattle. Do you understand? So bleaching. So many <laughs> stuffs. So many <laughs> <laughs> bleaching. Wow. So Anyways. many stuffs. You can't it's put okay. up. About stop, I, 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 stop. Stop BBL. I, I, I don't know. I don't know about the that. Because I'm what? not in the You want to do? Ah. She <laughs> <you> <laughs> want to do. It's apparent anyway. We're going wait, to wait, wait, wait. Before we go on break. Melody, break. Melody, do you want to do BBL? We're going on a quick break. Uh, and you. when we come back, Ooh. don't wow. forget that we've still got Timmy B in the building. Quincy Jones is here. And it's a still zero condition podcast. I'm having a ball. And we are um, currently showing on channel 189 on Pop Central. Shout out to Shiva. Shout out to Pop Central. Don't forget that we are still having this conversation. And the full thing is going to... Um, we're not having it on our audio platform, so just in case you miss anything on TV, the full thing comes out on Monday on your favorite streaming platform. We're still, you know, just suggesting. <laughs> what do you guys think about this year's BB Ninja? Be honest. Dead. So dead. Somebody Nothing. will win. 
<laughs> yeah, at the end of the yeah, day, of win more money than last year. Of but course, somebody will. What bro. do you think about the entire experience as compared to other I, previous I think it will. Oh, okay, sorry. And I'm asking Timmy B because go, I know go, that go. Timmy B. she's yeah, a Timmy yeah, B. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. apologist. Yeah, yeah. I'm really not. But um, I think that they should take a break. I really think so. What? I think B- production should take a Big break. Brother? Let's miss it for a bit. I think so. I think it's losing its impact ah. to um, make stars. To make stars. Yeah. Aside from even making stars, what about the 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 entertainment? Is it as entertaining? People also can't afford to watch it as much. Huh. Except you go on show max, but like cable is expensive. And in terms of like priority for a family, before I pay for cable, I've talked about a lot of things. But just in do you even look at the numbers of the people that as they're coming out the house made before you would have seen like 78 endorsement deals so the the conversion yeah it's we could say the economy though i mean yeah do you think the economy is affecting the other the, the contestants are not as interesting there's that as well but also the economy doesn't help i don't know about the contest to be honest right i've never been an ardent big well, brother yeah, me too. Yeah. watcher but i always see it on social media season, is you hear it. You hear just, you yeah. must hear it. Yes, yeah. I've not been now, hearing this. Yeah, I'm not. Uh, it's now the nation is more that want to now just me by force, right? Mm-hmm. I'm not even. They say sit down. Let me give you an update on me. And like, I don't really want to hear it. And it's not as it's, the conversation is not a lot on social media the way it used to be back in the day. Yeah, yeah. because just less people are watching. I, I, but no, I but, might be wrong when we see the numbers, like the numbers. But if, but, if less people are watching, will they tell us? Um, Possibly. No, they won't. <laughs> we um, can find out. Can we please so, just, yeah. so this is this is this oh, is okay. another thing about Big Brother. Where how many people are left in the house now, Timmy B? You, you, you should know. You would know. know. No? Surprising. Very surprising. I don't know. Very Guys, I'm just very good at my job. Just think about what I said and think no, about No, you used to be the one to welcome them from Big Brother House, yeah, like but I'm every just year. Very good at my job. So you don't mean that you'd be like in front of your television. So you don't it? watch it? I, I can't really admit that, but yeah, I actually don't want people like Ah, that. interesting. I'm just yeah. very good at You are job. very good at your job, actually. Ah. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> so yeah. everybody thinks that I just never watched Big Brother before. I even think that as you are driving, your Big Brother is on in your yeah. car. You shift the screen from the back seat to front. <laughs> or you, yeah. To be honest, I watch I, Insecure, that's what I watch. But Insecure is over, though. Yeah, I still watch it. It's like I watch it every day. It's just something I watch. Like you go back to watch old episodes. So, which is insecure? Isare is. Um, huh? Isare. Mm. That mm. one. So everybody Kouri? that knows me knows I watch insecure. Me, I think this insecure is a fantastic. <laughs> it's amazing. It's amazing, but Isare is not coming back anymore. But yeah, that's yeah, cool. Nice. <laughs> 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 what, what series do you binge? Isare. What have you seen before that you can't see again? Series reality, or movie? reality. No series, TV movie. Show. New stuff or old being anything? Yeah, anything. That you oh, before. I have I have a list that I must see every year. Of what? I'm one of those people. So which one is on that? Um, I'm about to kick off Harry Potter for the year. Um, what's wow. it called? I do Peaky Blinders every year. Um, Never seen that. Oh, you should. Mm. I think you would like it. Um, or not? <laughs> uh, what else do I watch every year? I think a couple. But those are like go to, and then Harry Potter is very special. I need to, I sit down. I just buy one new TV, laddies. So you just sit down. I you. sit down. I need I to watch George. Harry Potter I all over Harry again Potter. with a different emotion because half my favorite cast don't die. Yeah. I say, God, why? Mm-hmm. That's fine. S- Professor Snape's. Yeah. Um, what's that name? Michelle Mago. Watch Fantastic Beasts before you watch Harry Potter. Why? Because it'll give you context on some things happening in Harry Potter. It's like a prequel. Fantastic Beasts. Yeah. Prequel? Yeah. Since for, when? For Dumbledore. Yeah. Wow. I didn't even know that. Oh, 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 oh. Is it nice? It's fantastic. It's Harry yeah. Potter. Before Harry Potter. The two Dumbledores don't die. But like, why do you cast... This one. Okay, That's well, yeah, nice. Yeah, no, no, no. Isn't I get that. But it's just... <laughs> Like how we go cast for two world, guys and, and the two don't like die. This whole thing where Dumbledore was actually gay and they were partners and it's like a gay. Thing, yeah. Is that the the thing you said to watch? Yeah. 
Okay, thanks. Okay, thanks. No, no but like, I'm it's going to not keep there the in the thing. But of my it's Dumbledore. Like, if you're really into Harry Potter, you go read I am like, a, theories. I Harry Potter you can die. can see the, the connection. Thing, the connection. Because it's like, why were they so devoted to each other? They did an oh, so That's why they couldn't kill each other. So like, why? Maybe so that would just, give you context. They were lovers. Yeah, maybe. It's not that it's there. But, but if you think about it deeper, it kind of makes sense. I, I hear you on that. Oh, yeah. You you produce shows, you write shows, you direct stuff as well. Yeah, but I'm also like a yeah, Harry you Potter like that. fan. Like, I don't know. I don't know about this. this is show, producer, and director no, things. No, she's Harry saying that she's actually like a, a big... Did big they fan. say that Dumbledore is gay inside that thing? No, they didn't. Did they That's insinuate exactly that he might said. be gay? She said... <sighs> Wait, first, I'm asking that you question. You lack comprehension skills. Tell me if Can't you insult me one more time, we're going to have a problem. I'm not insulting you. I'm speaking Honestly speaking, English we, you, if, no, well. on a very serious like, note, I'm, I like, do not how appreciate can you not that. I comprehend what I'm saying to you right now. <laughs> if I you, literally if, said there is none of that in the show. So how but did you, how did how did you have end it? up with that? We are back home on TV. Quincy, yeah. if you want how to, did you end up with that? If you want to fight Timmy B, do you want to get back? Do you want to take her outside? Yeah. Not yeah. yet, after the show. Okay, so cool. So but we're back. Timmy, how did you end up oh with that? Oh my God, zero condition. That that like, might, fan yeah. theory. Like, I literally said it that you go read stuff and you read things. Context. Quincy, you and Timmy B can fight outside. But, anyways, on the PDD conversation and everything that's been happening with oh PDD. My God. Yeah, sorry, PDD. Did it. Did it. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Sorry? Mm hmm? Mm hmm? You're saying? Do you have proof? PDD what? Sorry, <laughs> point, that he did it? Are you the, point I'm, the, the, the direction I'm going with the question is that I saw people having a conversation about like, um, you know, Hollywood, the PDD stuff and saying that people that are acting like it's a shocker is very pretentious because they feel like it has been going on for a while in the industry, in their industry. And, you know, that cleansing is important. Do you think that that is something you would want to see in our in Nigeria. I I was interviewing Ladipo I think yesterday and I asked him, do you think this sort of stuff happens in Nigeria? And he's like, yeah, it definitely does. And you said yes. Yeah, and I think it does. It just you know I think it does. I think there's some very nasty stuff that happens here, but we're not wow. a society that holds anybody accountable for anything. So before any any of that happens, it's going to take a while. Because say you report now, and so what? And then, like, what happens? What is really going to happen? It's also, this is an upside-down society. This is a society where, like, we have illegal legalities. So, like, everything sort of goes in this sort of setup. So we're not yet there. And that's how it was then, you know, back in the day. In, in Hollywood, all of these things, some people would just be hip to the fact that it's wrong. At the time, it might just have been a thing that everybody was doing. And even here, as a woman, I'm sure in the industry, you've had experiences that just don't add up, you know. Oh. But you just, you know. You're just like, oh. You kind of like. A day in the life. You go with the flow. Sometimes, as it's happening, you don't even know it's inappropriate until you think about that thing. And like, yeah, that didn't make any sense a lot of p weird people have done a lot of weird things to me and i i started doing like this thing since i was 12 like i was doing like shows in secondary school hmm. with we were like supposed to do life early. idris abdu karim and all these sort of Ooh. people back in the day and peace square's first show actually in in lagos it was my show at queen's college they would yeah so a lot of things have happened that are just not you blank it out of your mind. Yeah, you blank it out of your mind. I, I like, hear you on that, actually. You blank it out of your mind, but there are a lot of weird things that I hear happen. you. I actually hear you on the blanking outside. Mm -hmm. Quincy, sorry. As a man, I know this is not your like, experience and shit. Oh, is it? For me, no. Luckily. Yeah. Lucky you. Yeah. Shout out to you for being a man. No, no, no. Yeah. I'm not even... Mm -hmm. No, not about... Oh, there are a lot of men that face stuff as well. I thought you were saying oh, that you think, no, I mean, lucky me not for not being a woman, but okay. lucky me for not being one of the guys that experiences whatever they experience. Yeah, because guys Whatever well. they have experienced. Because this, this is the creative industry in a whole. This is not just music industry. Because even yep. in Hollywood, there's Ashikacha, there's yep. actors, there's yes. all these people. Yes. Yes. But music, in the creative fashion. industry in a whole, you know, fashion, like film, like, you know, men are also getting, like, molested yep, and, like, you know diddled in this in this society as well and i think that 
That's crazy. It's really crazy. And one day everything will bust. This one one day last I can't last wait. last last. I, I want that bust. to happen so badly. Yeah, so I, I want that to happen so we'll badly. See. So um I have a very weird question. Yes, please go on. Is it possible that Okay, so being in the industry that we are, mm -hmm. there's a pos there's a tendency to normalize certain behavioral patterns mm -hmm. or certain things because you are at a certain stage in life. Mm -hmm. Is it possible that this is not really as bad as they're painting it? Did he? Yes, No, please. it's not possible. That he beat Cassie is enough. No, yes. That yeah. was very fucked so up. That, that's A hundred percent. So everything else that's is That's not extra. the part I'm speaking to. The no, but that's enough. The, the, all of... That's enough. To be arrested for yes. and all of that. Yes. yes that's, so that's it. That is fine. Full stop. Like so are we for that speaking conversation. to violence, or are we speaking to that? It's already like random you already have questionable guys. character. If you, as a man, can beat her to that degree, it's obvious. It's also not the first time. So even if it's just for that one person, it is enough. And the fact that you even did that, in, you did you did that like <coughs> openly, openly. Yeah. So in why did you feel so like untouchable? So that is enough. That? It is enough. Everything okay, else so is extra. Okay, so we're speaking to we're speaking to the violence. Like he's in jail. Absolutely. Like he he's in prison. That. That's. So, full I, I think Chris is speaking more on the sexual part that maybe he's not so much of a pervert or he's not so, he's not the, so much the, of a. Diddy's story is thought. no longer about beating Cassie. Yes, of course, it's about his Any sexual more. inappropriate is character. The, the, is everybody coming out? Ton of people him of now have woken up this. to come out to say he did this, he did that, and is looking really familiar to no, not putting him on the same level, or whatever the conversation is with Ooh, MJ, no. Michael Jackson. Okay. It's not the same. Michael mm. Jackson was pedophilia. This one is just straight up sex trafficking. I think and a lot of is, things trapped. Does he have a fifty foot worse. bed in his backyard? Yes. Did he have these parties? Yes. Did, Did he, he have like 1, 000, the evidence whatever, is all over yeah. there? Even in terms of imagery for his own music, he sort of replicates that. You see, past the Cavossier video, it looks like a freak off. Do you remember that video? Then with the uh, bass robes, past the Cavossier, everybody's that singing now. That's the same video that had Megan. That had JT. To have that. No, this is old. I'm not saying it is not the first person, but all the it's all there. Like you can see it. It's there. There's nothing to say. This man fancied himself, I would think, as like the Hollywood party boy that just gives people a good time. You know, he was just a very good host to him. He was a very good host. He probably did not understand how he was crossing the line. I just need to get these people happy. I guess that was his way of like having an in into society. You go to a Diddy party, Diddy will show you a good time, and then you owe me something. And then it I was can in call you. And then I can call you and be like, go oh, hey, I have this. a naked video so of you. It was just a way for, me? for him to get in. And like, in this industry, networking is it, really. It's just having one up on everybody. Ah, this person do this for me. Yes, this actually. This person do this for me. Yes. That's how he was probably getting along. But getting along in this very, very, very messed up way. And... Yeah, I believe every single thing that is being said about Didi because everything is there to see it kind of tracks. I don't care about the specifics of oh, there's what Nick he did. Here, yeah. what, are you a bad person? Yes. Do you deserve to be in jail till you die? Yeah, which is not long, really. How old is he? His life expectancy 30, 40 years for what he's done, that's enough. So yeah, that and amazingly, die you know, you've had End so much story. fun. It's not like you were born. Exactly, you were not entire, poor. You had the, 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 the fun had that he has time. had. Some people might never have it for the rest of their Exactly. Years. When I say so, fun, I don't mean the sexual assault part. I'm talking about you know him being rich, him being able to fly, him having access to like good things of life. You've had that for a good number of years, so you're not really missing anything by being. In yeah, and making there was making the band. He was very abusive to those people on that show. It's everything is just there, plain to see. Unfortunately, Even after that, we're signed to the record label. They've all complained. Do you understand? Mace, 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 and Beta. Well, Mace left her many times and has kept on telling us everything that is happening today. I don't understand why we're making a case for Didi. Please, I beg. He's a, a black person. A Please, black let me be, let like, me be very clear. That even I'm if he beats only Cassie, that's enough. You're a black person. Go to jail and go to bed. Yeah. Period. Period. Okay, that's <laughs> Period. That's fine. But but yeah, I, I I definitely hear what you're saying, and I, and I find this 
thing that black people do. This is not a coincidence thing where, you know, somebody get accused of something. You see people say, why is he always a black man that is trying to get down? No, why it's not, not even about the black not people you. saying, no, to be honest. No, this is a different you. conversation. Yeah. I said not you. I said not you. I said black people. Mm -hmm. I get that. There's a rich man or a rich man. I'm like, why are they coming for all the black rich men? Before... Um, before PDD, they did it to R. Kelly, they did it to Bill Cosby, they did it, can't you see the pattern? I see the pattern of abuse too. Yeah, you're just bad people. It's not about color. I see the pattern of abuse too. Harvey so Weinstein people, was in jail. I see the, the other guy of who abuse offed himself too. was in prison for the same thing. People should just stop That's doing true. bad things. Yeah. Exactly, and I don't know why... The, it doesn't excuse... Your race does not excuse the fact that you did a bad thing. Did you do it? Are they lying against you? Exactly. No. So, so what's all these black people... Face black your people? L as a bad person. Then I say, how many white Period. people are... Have they been... Have they, have they arrested for doing the same thing? That's a different conversation. Yeah, but are you bad? Yeah. You're still Period. a pedophile, so go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. It's just... It's just what it yeah, is. I'm not sorry about it. Yeah. Anyways, um, so speaking about artists... What do you guys think about the entire Cardi B and Offset situation? I love Cardi. I love everything about her. I love that she did what she did. Kudos to her. And I love it. I saw on TikTok, and I think this is why men are mad. Um, this person had said that men are not mad because Cardi got her lick back. No. Men are mad, mad because Cardi is a trendsetter. You know, she gave us purr, like she gave us all these things. She gave us, you know, she gave us these things and we, we take it and go. So now it's like, okay, now <laughs> getting your lick back is now going to be a trend. And like, my baby's going to start <laughs> fucking the next man on me and shit, I'm not ready. That's really why men are mad. Because it makes perfect sense. This man has been cheating on her since 2017 that we've known about their dating. She broke up with him. He did not agree. He would show up at shows to beg her. She went and beat somebody up because the person was sleeping with her man, which lost her deals. Got her in jail. No, she in, didn't she go to jail, go to jail but, but she was in court. She had day. to pay because of this man. And then and his shiny I belts. did my own one little, little like lick back, and now you're mad. Wow. But what do you bro. think about the conversation? Quincy, I want to hear from you as a man. You've been, you've been, you've been <laughs> so quiet. As a man, what do you think about this? And do you think she went to the extreme doing like allegedly cheating? I don't even think she did. I just she, think she, she said it. She did. Just she, because. She, no, that's the accusation. And she, she not said, I did. Yeah, she said, yeah, but, and did. No, and did. So I want to put that on a t shirt. Is, and did. Wait, so the question is, was this after she had broken up with him or... They're, they're saying that she cheated while she was pregnant. Yes. So that's the one that is really off in their mind. That's where the problem is. Why is that a problem? <laughs> <laughs> Look, Chris, I, I, I want to hear your you, theory. Bro, I, I don't... So, you see, hmm. the way women process things hmm. to me sometimes is <laughs> Because I said was cheating on her while wait, she on, was pregnant. Well, I don't know while so he, was he was pregnant, you understand? Know both pregnant. You know understand? He was, he was, man. He was in the club, naki, bastardly. I'm going, to, I'm going to say something that. <laughs> oh, the person is shaking head. Exactly. Like, like men like cannot man. take oh. it. Like you guys will be naki. Oh, oh you know, men will, men will be like, yeah, I can <laughs> doggy somebody else's baby, but I cannot imagine them dogging my baby. But are you insane? So why is it for that she's pregnant? What is lying? good for I'm the goose? It's good for. I'm sorry. Women thinking that we are the same. We when are. Hold on. Do may that. I speak? That is you the, may, you may. May I speak? Yeah. Leave him, please leave him. Leave Women him. thinking that we're the same <laughs> is absolutely ridiculous. Please explain, please explain, bro. Then, Brother in man. this conversation, yeah. bro, just chill. I'm chilling in this man. conversation, I, I can't take you're carrying my bloody child <laughs> and you're allowing a random ass nigga. Stick he's his not penis. random. Apparently, he's a top NFL baller. Bro, that's richer he than can her suck either. it for all anybody cares. <laughs> okay. Right? Random ass nigga <laughs> is out here sticking his penis <laughs> in the same <laughs> hole that my baby, my <laughs> child, ah, will come out from. Okay. I what think I you guys mean? think is what does it mean? So are you saying so wait? So that, you're not concerned. It means it's sacred about the to be pregnant. It's just, it means it's sacred shut. to give life. It means it's sacred to, to not allow this random fucking penis 
get on my bloody on that vagina. Okay, calm down. Wait, wait, if it wasn't when she was pregnant, would it be better? It will be a lot better. Okay, so, so wait, it's so, so wait, disgusting. Wait, 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 the fact that she's pregnant. Wait, wait, is understand it, that it's easier for you. Is the penis entering the baby's mouth? No, listen, 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 listen. Let me tell you how men think about things like this. Let me tell you. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah. The baby just called on. Melody, Melody, listen, 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 listen. You're a woman. You would understand the biology to that. Okay. Men have chosen to intentionally not understand. Right, a That's lot of men actually disease. still think that. Wait, a lot of men still think that if you're doing that, you're probably going to touch the baby's head. Like, That's okay. It's but not, that is listen, never gonna be that big. bruv. Okay. You see how you people <laughs> even <laughs> think of your bodies is not how we think of it. Okay. So if you're your pregnant, you're a point. god. Okay. Right, you're why birthing he, something new. God you're her? doing. Why, listen, why was he listen. God listen. When, she was, when she was pregnant, no, why no, was he cheating? No, no, no. It's a random side piece, bro. It's a very bro. I'm just trying to bust a nut. And she's also okay. trying to you bust a pussy. Not in the that. vagina. That's fucking carrying my baby. Oh well, okay. the vagina is not in the baby. Okay. But um, the, like, the baby is not in the okay. vagina. It does not but connect. not in that fucking hole. No, no don't do that. Don't sorry, do that. That's, that's, no, that's, that's, that's very weird. weird. That's this, very, very see, you weird. see where the problem Men is. Men and women are different biologically, but that's a whole My it's, point exactly. Like, it's just fuck. She's fucking like fucking. Mm -hmm. different. Why not oh, keep yourself as such? Your hormones, Why don't you keep yourself? No, but when you're pregnant, huh? your hormones Why are like keep are on overdrive. And yes. he's not at home, he's busy fucking other people. And it's, so it's a random ass, ass nigga also that will be sticking penis also, in her vagina. Why are you with random ass babes when, when your wife is pregnant? You are home and your wife is pregnant. You make a valid point, I'm but it's really. not comparable. It is extremely it's comparable. Not. I'm very sorry. It's actually diabolical. For My a man baby to be is in your belly. When, That's yes, the so difference. What are you cheating on me when I'm actually uh, a whole ass human? Baby. is in your belly, you know and you're allowing you random like niggas you know stick penises in, in you. Risky endeavor. Do you know how many women? This is, let's let's not even like. Let's be actually very for real. I'm here. being very serious. No, no. Taking as a woman, taking having your baby is a fucking risk on my own life. That is a point in time that you understand I am making a sacrifice for us as a family unit to conti continue your, life your legacy. Really? Because it's not my surname the baby will have. Really, when push comes to serve, they will tell you, now nah, you're... Now, 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 now the husband picking, really, at the end of the day. So I'm doing this, risking my life for you on a daily basis. Do you know what it means to be pregnant? You're throwing up, you're having balls, you are going through life. You're literally carrying and something respect, that is eating from I, you. Excuse I me, because I let that. you talk. In that, that time, time you are now finish. telling me that instead of I'm you to be grateful it. and watching over me hand and foot, you're out there in the strip club fucking some hoes, and I should be what, at home praying mm. for you? Are you fucking stupid? So you the decide day, to take being... the baby to go and knock a random. She decided no, to go and do that. Are you insane? She didn't take the baby. She, 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 she took insane? her pussy to go and fuck. Are you okay? She took her pussy yes, with the baby in the no, bed. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. No, no, no. no. It's how you guys are defending for, this no, no, for me. No, no, no. It's a pain. Forget about. I see. And that's the problem. I see. You see, this is the problem I have with women. Again, I've said routine. I've said look at a person and look at level of their lives and what awareness is zero. She's a very very family-oriented. For oh, me. Yes. That's what. Because as a man, Cardi B was pregnant. Offset, you were pregnant because your wife is pregnant. You're also a pregnant man. Well, you're not carrying a baby, but you also have a baby on the way. Oh my God, so you're supposed so to much be female mass. You're supposed to be in the house with your wife, right? No, well, so while you were pregnant, you took your prick to go and fuck another person. But while she's carrying the baby, she cannot carry her own pussy to go and collect no, she can't. I'm no, very no, sorry. No, but can you not understand the injustice of that? I apologize. Forget, 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 forget for what? I apologize. Forget, forget, forget her even getting her lick back. Do you know what that does? Get your lick back, but no, my Excuse baby me. in your calm belly. Down. Of course, remove No, calm down. No, we're actually being, I'm you actually really fucking pissed off. I'm really, really triggered because you don't understand what that does emotionally to somebody. Especially in that time. So it is absolutely woman. okay me, that she went context. to fuck forget outside. The, forget the fuck okay. now. Forget what she did. Hey, go the, the thought of that as a woman, forget Cardi B is in a superstar who has not put out an album, not because she can't, because she's taken her time out 
for this Creates man a family, to yeah. build a family. She has yes, reduced I herself agree. to increase herself. She has lost herself for this person. She's making this sacrifice for the family and you are still on street. Again, this is not the first time. Since the beginning of their relationship, he has been yes. cheating on her and, he and getting her badly. pregnant all the time. Yes. As he's cheating, he's getting her pregnant. This is a sick individual. She is in pain and now has three children. All of this happened. And do you know what he said? I made you a baby mama and I won. That is not a person that is normal. You think that if she did get... Again, I don't think she did it because if you look at who she is, She's always been a family person. I don't she think has she did taken that, her she has taken his other children as her own. They are on her Instagram page. She's posting them. She's taking them to salon. These are things that normal women will not do. And you're still fucking around on her. She can't. She did the one and it's a big deal. Fuck you guys. Fuck you, Quincy. Fuck you in wow. the asshole. That's so a lot. the fuck? Are you joking? That's a lot. So Can you not like so Timmy? No, I, bro, I, I, I I'm not. When people so, say when men give excuses for this thing, you can't take the one. I've given you a history of this person that has been in the public eye. This there, woman no lost deals because you were cheating and there's embarrassing no me. Cardi B, I'm also a rapper. Every two market days, the other rappers are saying, and oh, that's this is the only thing, that that the only thing they have on Cardi B. You. You're fucking, and you're a fucking embarrassment to me as, as well. Like the and you're saying that, link. oh, that should not pain you. Men will do less for less. I can I will look at a man like this. You will go and cheat your own because I looked at a man. I agree. So, so what are you talking I about? Agree. Let us he be human. Up. I hate that. I, when men have no sense and no intelligence, the next argument is, Men and women are not equal. Give me an argument that makes sense. That is the daftest thing I've ever heard. I'm talking about oh, bloody biology. Same. Biologically, they're, yes, they're, they're different. Um, when you cheat relax. on me, it hurts relax. me. When, you, when I cheat on you, it hurts. So if it hurts everybody, don't do it. Are you cheating on don't me do with a baby in your belly? Uh, are you, can you, are you this baby bloody alone? serious? Can you please leave this baby? The baby, the baby I'm telling you, bro, the baby bro, bro, listen, not, listen, listen, listen. The baby is not complaining to you. Maybe he's not having any problem with I this fuck. Going, Can you no. please? Honestly, now, because she I'm has so a baby, don't send her the baby I'm so in this happy conversation. I came on this podcast. The baby so is where the problem is. The baby no, is where the problem how? is. Because first and foremost, Bro, if you fucked around, nobody will give a fuck. So tell me, how does that It baby? is deserving. Okay, it does me. not. Please, so exactly. But the concept of you being pregnant uh -huh. and fucking a random guy uh -huh. is where the problem is. How does it affect the baby? Have you not heard that it is not... It is not affecting the baby. So why are you, why you keep mentioning with my baby, with my baby, with my baby? It's my fucking baby, What's bro. What's with the sex that she sex with her vagina? <laughs> oh, fuck. Jesus Christ. What's the connection with your, your baby? is okay, chilling. Oh, soon, lower, lower. Like, oh, soon. <laughs> like, oh, soon, lower, lower. Because they're complete, protected. Oh, okay, bro, chill. Bro, bro. And so she what could have cheated. Been? She could have cheated on numerous she occasions. Couldn't she couldn't That wait. had... Every other she possibility, she she's right? Going. She's and that's okay. So this is where I'm going. So, yeah. wait, 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 wait. This is where I'm going. You're absolutely right. Offset is an asshole, mm -hmm. and I'm not even going to lie. It's mm -hmm. facts. He has fucked up because, in fact, in my own books, he's she Cardi B is the reason why he's even still relevant, bro. On facts, Migos aren't anymore. That's reality. They're, 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 don't but like I'm going to. Bro, You see, there are certain ways that women get back at men. That's a little too much. If in general. Is, hold, on, hold, much hold on, pay. hold on, First to do, no, they pay. Yeah, I don't believe that anything yeah, I You guys do, say that, but it's, it's it. not, it doesn't equate. No, it, it does. does. Like, it does. wait, listen, it fucking does. a random, wait, I'm going, to, I'm going to branch out just a little okay, bit. Okay, let's branch out. Fucking a random guy, mm. having that random guy's child and saying it's mine. That's a lot. Mm -hmm. That's but you guys you do mean. it. and No, no, no. Hold so on. Hold on. About. Hold on. He said he's branching Hold out. on. Right? I did mention I was branching yeah. out. Yeah. Right? So you do that and you think it's all right because I That's fucked a right. random bitch. That's bro, not right. Bro, bro. No, it's justified though. No, it's not. Probably in Timmy's mind, it's justified, it's justified too. Maybe. That can never be justified. Oh, listen, that listen, nope. listen. So that's not justified. I didn't say you're... But you I didn't just say said that in Timmy's to mind. You. So I, that's a daft I say it might be. No, no it's not. I'm yeah. telling you, okay. it's, not. it's not a daft Calm. I'm not a daft person. Oh, so my God. Take it easy with the word. I'm mm -hmm. not going to. Why? Because we are doing talking a lot. I'm talking so a lot. As you want to be talking, me too, I'll be talking. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh -huh. oh, so yeah. I'm saying this to say that. Look. Look. 
In women's minds. In women's minds. Stop it. Dude, stop, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. All right. Thank you. So next question. Next question. <laughs> Keep going. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's done. It's done. Okay, it's no, done. I don't want to be that person. It's, it's done. Okay. It's no, done. It's done. done. <laughs> you give it up. You give it up. Bro. No, I don't want to be the person that I like to talk about. No, wait. But I don't like this argument of women's mind and men's mind. Okay, what's it to the women's mind? Say it, Quincy. Sometimes you guys take things too far. <laughs> yes, that's just the summary. You guys take things too far as a way of get back. Right? I don't think that's she just too far. It. I actually don't, don't think so. But if she did that, that was a lot. It's not enough. Yeah, that, that was a lot. I, 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 I think you are picturing the baby that is chilling now. Bro, I, I, I don't it, it even make any. Jesus Christ. It is not enough. I feel vomit. You feel like Wapake? You clean after her. Huh? That she's already vomited because of the thought of him with another random ass baby while she was dying and carrying their baby. So, yeah. And I think that we also As I forget. Said, he it. fucked up, but doing that? No, man. So, mm-hmm. I, I feel like now they can Jesus now Christ. cancel each other. Like, okay, you've done your own and done it. Okay, so now let's go back to the table. But, you yeah. Just, you yeah, know, yeah, oh, Jory, I've done your own, I've done my own. Even yeah. not equal. So, now so we cannot cross our legs and say, ah. okay, so where are we now? Indeed. Oh, you for me, one word do it. Jesus. Indeed. Andy, um, somebody maybe because I'm African, no. somebody ah, had um, to do it. Someone had so, to what? And did. You fuck, going to fuck, do it, fuck, so. fuck, ah, Jesus. Yeah, he, he, and he even got her pregnant as revenge, as people. The funny part of the conversation is that even when people are even saying this thing about, oh, oh, Offset got her pregnant, I don't even agree because Kadibi is a very rich woman. She's a very rich artist. She kind of. Offset got her what? Got her pregnant. I feel like they both wanted the baby, and Cardi B has always loved family. I feel like yeah. she just felt like she was having it with Offset. Maybe that is the problem. But as a woman, she as a person wanted children. Yeah. I think Offset is just a dickhead that was just acting like her. 100%. somebody with a shining belt. So wait, the the narrative is that Offset got her pregnant yeah, as that's what that's just said. daft. That's that's daft. I think so. That's also removing our own Doesn't make any sense. The it's stupid. But, but, but yeah. But I, th- I think all is well and good in the kingdom. No, it's Everything not. Everything is fine. It's not. You know, the, the sky is blue. Everybody's fine. Offset can be mad. I think it's okay now. They'll still get back together. And that'll be fine. Yeah. I think that'll be fine. Yeah. That'll be really fine. Yeah. If if that, that happens, I would I would like they that. Seem like no, they shouldn't. They shouldn't. I they think they should. Like the no, they I think shouldn't. they should. I think they should. And maybe she should now do something else again. I'm like, so now, even. And did times two. Times two. So she do, she do, and did. It's okay that I she fucks that somebody. I called and did, yeah. She might just do that. Then, yeah. then have a song called "Right Up Ali." Just nice bangers for babes to just feel nice and cute. They should be lick back. Track one, lick back. I finna get my lick back. Lick Ooh. back. I finna, I finna get, get my lick back. Lick back with my baby, baby in the tummy. Lick that. Ding 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 Congrats. What she's wearing bikini. Shout out to Burner Boy. I told them. Uh, Timmy. Yeah, 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 Timmy, yeah. Timmy, oh, Timmy. No. Yeah. <laughs> I told him. <laughs> Timmy, imagine her recording that song and shooting a video for it with her pregnancy. Ah, that would be mad. And like, uh, let, that would be fucking fire. Please don't fire. touch me. Then she's not twerking. <laughs> then the stomach will be doing plum, plum. Ooh. So now, once you're seeing that, you'll we'll be never remembering what ah, happened. Ah, I'm saying. Oh, my, oh, my, she lied. Oh, my. Good afternoon, oh, my son. From Atlanta speaking. And guess what? Nobody... I think you did see that. My wife has food video. Can you see this evil thing she's doing to me? <laughs> Shara, for being real. <laughs> Shara, for being real. <laughs> Shara. Yes. Okay. Drink the milk tea. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> anyway, so you say you're traveling tomorrow. Where are you going? Ah, well, tell me. Actually, do you know? I don't know. Um, I have no idea. So, how long are you going to be away for? I know I'm going to be away for two weeks, I think. Do you like, honestly, as someone who has been on radio for a while, are you tired of being on radio? That is a very, very interesting question. Yes, I know. I have my days where I'm just like, I'm done with this. And then I have days that are just great. Just reminds me why like, I like this job. And it, it's in the interaction with normal people. I think so. I mean, I've met people that I have changed their lives. I've met people that were almost going to kill themselves and they listened to my show and they didn't, do, they didn't do that. Yeah. So when I remember that, and sometimes, you know, I have a good time on radio. Yeah. Um, I'm like, yeah, I really like this. I've always wanted to do this since I was 12. So, yeah. like, yeah, I have my days. Quincy, what about you? Do you miss being on the radio? 
be honest. Yeah. What do you miss about it? I I don't even. <clears throat> Excuse me, I don't even know particularly. Okay, so sometimes... I'm sure it's not Sometimes... Oh, <laughs> fuck no. Fuck no, bro. We need to even talk about that at some point. Today. Um, what's the word? Thank you for your money. I'm not asking you. We need to talk as about... As an exec in the space. My name Management. <laughs> yes, now. As management. Management. Yeah, you management. No, you're not barely. Let's not do this. Don't, don't take yourself out now. I don't, I don't, <laughs> let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Yeah, I'm very like, like, what do I... Why, I, 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 I it's true. Let's leave her. Let's just yeah. Um, our, 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 you know, our one. Nobody gets paid enough in Nigeria, just so you know. I agree. Except the people Nobody that gets get paid, paid enough, enough in Nigeria. Yeah, yeah I agree. Except like, as staff members like yeah. working of anywhere. any organization. Yes. <laughs> Honestly. That's cap, man. I'm sorry. No, it's not No, cap. it's okay. To, Even the people that are earning okay a good salary are not being paid. They're not being I, paid I enough. That. If you compare okay the same say, role in a foreign yes, country. I'm totally understood. Yeah. Right? The concept of human wants and... It's you not know. even once. It's not it, about it is, it is. I'm talking it's about needle. just in general. Is nobody's paid needle, what they're worth. What need. Nobody's paid if what that's the worth. situation, then nobody in the world is getting paid what they're worth. No, people in developed countries are being paid How? what they're worth. How do you know that? Because I know them. I have yeah, sisters and, and family you, that you think that they Yeah, because that's, that's your mindset to that figure or to that job role and the amounts that's attached to it. The same way you're saying, listen, bro, the same way you're saying no one gets paid well in the country could be the same way they're saying that over there. I said not what they're worth in the country. Like, Still the same. It's like doctors are not getting paid what they're worth. In Nigeria. In Nigeria. You can't compare, like, to, you can't compare that to are what not doctors being paid are getting paid outside worth. of Nigeria. Lawyers are not being paid what they're worth. Engineers are not being like, paid what they're there's worth. There's so many people. Is it cameramen? Is it like... People are overworked and underpaid. Is it actors? You know, everybody complains that they just are not getting paid what they're worth. Yeah. Because we don't even have structure in the country, just in general, that also helps. So there's a guide. Like, apart from minimum wage... Other industries don't have that. Versus if you're in the US, you, you have an agent as an owner personality. You have an agent, you have contracts, oh, sure. things are negotiated. You, have, you have, you know, so you there's... Have to do a lot of things by so it's not only... Yes, here we're very freestyle because everything yeah. is like private agency, but yeah. we have... Government also has some sort of role to play in terms of just regulation. Abroad, there's like... The, the biggest employers of labor in the media, like in the UK, I might be wrong, but I think it's the BBC. So it's even government. You know, so everything is... We just don't have that here. And it's everywhere. It's for lawyers, it's for screenwriters, it's for producers, well, for okay. everybody. People are just generally not paid what they're worth. So, I mean, it's why everybody has more than one job. Yeah. You Devil's work, advocate. You work, yes. Devil's advocate. Yeah. Considering the state of the current economy, do you still think that people are not getting paid what they're worth? It's even worse for the state of the yes. economy. Yes. Whether the echo, like it's, it's always worse. been the case. It's even worse now. It's always been that. And that's why you have to do more than, you than one do. thing. Because even you know? the money that you're earning now, how many companies are increasing salaries? This is not like generally, how many companies are increasing salary based on the bad state of the economy? You're you know, right about that. Salary, you're right about that. People are still earning the same money, but inflation everywhere. So how are they supposed yeah, to Yeah, and they're balance? not also yeah. making money. And sometimes those people are not even making enough money to increase your salary. <coughs> to, exactly. That's where I'm going. Mm -hmm. That's the point I'm going. It's not just about the employees. What about the employers? Are they making money? Are they breaking? But they making. That's what I mean by the time. economy. It's everybody. So I mean, the yeah. alternative will be sometimes to just like lay off people or just shut down the, yes. the whole business. Yes. And that, what does that do? It just pushes more people into labor. So it's like we're in a very weird place, where it's like some people, some people are bad people. And they just don't want to pay. Yeah. But there's some people who genuinely want to pay, but they just can't find ways. And then they do other things to sort of cushion what they can. So like they give you staff bus, or there's like do hybrid. Some people yes. stay three days. You don't have to come so five days a it's, week. It's, it's yeah. difficult times for everybody across yeah. board. Um, I agree. So yeah, I mean, what can you do? The alternative is everybody gets fired. How excited are you as a person about? Um, you know, for one thing that is very big on radio and broadcasting and just, you know, being media people, they're always talking about like, oh, before you say something on radio, you need to get your information correct, you mm -hmm. need to be very, very sure, you need to fact check. And now that we live in a world where people can just go on social media and just say things, 
without necessarily needing to fact check and those things can go viral. How do you feel about, you know, VDM and the information that he gives out on social media? What do you feel about his brand of activism? Even though he's still an activist, what do you feel about him as a person and him using his platform to fight for this, fight for that, talk about this, call this out, share this information, share that information? What do you think about his entire movement as a person? Using this Bobrisky saga as an to, example. To be fair, I haven't, like, really watched any of his videos. Ever. Ever. Um, it's not, it's because... I'm just like, I have a lot of things to do in life. And I just don't have time to like sit down and really digest. But I understand his whole thing. And I think, I mean, initially it's, it was well-intentioned. But I think just the thing about us is sometimes you have to pick your battles. And then you have to do it in a strategic way, especially if your goal is to do something bigger than just ridicule a person. Mm -hmm. So if the if the idea was to like bring down corruption in the Nigerian prison system. I think it could have been better organized done in a better way to actually catch the corruption in the Nigerian prison system versus making this person like a, a thing. Not saying that he shouldn't have put the fact that if it, it is true, mm -hmm. because all of this is allegedly yeah. at the end of the day, everybody's your word against mine. We yeah. don't know what is true at what this point not, in time yes. or what is not true at this point in time. Yeah. And as journalists at the same time, you can't place, you can't just say this person did this or this, this. You have mm -hmm. to look at what is in front of you and say, well, according to this person, same, according, according to, to this person. person. So if his aim is to, people have done this, like people across the globe have opened up our eyes to the ills of society and different governments and yeah. haven't had to do all of this. I mean, you're talking about Femi Falano in a way that you can't even prove that anything you've said is, tr is and true. And he actually did an interview saying he never spoke to Babuski. He has never spoke to Babuski. Exactly. And this is a man that has... Put his life on the line time and time. And again. his name. And yeah. from... This guy was... Felakusi's lawyer, he's been fighting against the government. He's been jailed so many times mm -hmm. during the military regime. He is a freedom fighter. He's the guy. He is the guy for everybody. Yes. And you just come and... Undoubtedly. You know, and it's just the excitement of the time. You just feel like you can say anything because people... But the same way he's trying to place consequences on people for their actions, he should be ready to get consequences for his actions when he does these things. I just think if people just need to be more careful. And if you are not looking for self-glory and self-like whatever, there's better ways to do things to actually catch the thief. You know, that's what I think. What do you think? Um, with the Femi Falano situation, he goofed. Uh, but before then, um, I don't think I have really had, maybe how he says what he says, but I don't have a problem with VDM. I don't, problem, I don't have a problem then. with the trajectory of his activism. I don't have a problem with whatever he picks or whatever he chooses. It might be vendetta-driven, but sometimes at the results gotten, yes, they are. Are a lot of people facing the law for putting out products that are not supposed to be in circulation? Yes, they are. So in general, for the most part of what he does, I don't have a problem. In recent times with the level of credibility that someone like Femi Falano and Fowles has, yeah, yeah. he goofed on that one. He really messed up. Yeah, I personally am disappointed for that, to be very honest. The get back at the possibility that the issues he was facing was probably caused by Bob Risky, mm -hmm. and now he has led to the possibility of viewing a um, corrupt prison alleged corrupt um, prison, system. prison system that's good that's good so i don't know man i try to see the, the good in any form of prison reform obviously. prison reform no um no so i mean at the end of the day right at the end of the day however nigeria chooses to nigeria now it's understood yeah. but do we know that there's a possibility or allegedly or this goes on. that Didn't this we happens. That? No, it's not we. We're real. second guessing. It's, Come it's on. not all, we. All those, no, it's sorry, not all we. All those people that are in 
Come on. Guys. It's not a we thing because a lot of people the go to jail populace. for le- way less. It's just some people are the still general populace have no holding, right? Mm-hmm. Not genuine sentencing. Some people see they rot there for yeah. years. But that, I don't think that's in you question. Know? What is in question is that influential people go into the prison system and don't actually stay in prison. Yeah. I don't and think, I think that think is something that people, that people did yeah. not know. Even with politicians, I, when I, they come and say they have taken come them on, to jail, did you I did they not know. Kill, kill, kill. Yeah, I don't have proof, say. so I did not know. Okay, maybe not proof. Did you not but. have... The, so did you have the perception that when normal is there a possibility? influential people... Yeah. Like, that's my point. Everybody, nobody thinks... No, I'm not going to say nobody, but like... A lot of people don't think that ex-governors and ex-presidents and ex-ministers go to jail and actually stay in general populist. But why not do? But like even yeah, but the place that's alleged that Bobrisky stayed was that they have was that prison? I don't know what they said, but they had said according to what I heard allegedly, they put him in a special place because they were going to tear him up. Yeah. yeah, that's what like the prison system steady. is saying. Yep. Yeah. That they did that because they were good. It's like don't the we, same way Diddy about, was put mean, in, like. Okay, well, you can't do that. Like, did, like Diddy's not going to be in gen pop. He's not in gen pop. He's going to die. Do you know what I mean? Like, it makes sense. Do you understand? They put him in a separate place. I'm not saying they are corrupt as hell, but we've known this. I think if you were trying to create reform in the prison system, this freestyle show about did that. He literally Bro, went how undercover. Many what did they like say? Like he did. But you see, that is Nobody a blatant. Said a that is not an allegedly. Again. Yes. Do you understand? That is like, he fam, went I was the there. Mention that to and, that guy. And exactly. Though. I respect that. That's like hard work. He That's also did the custom doing work. Doing the, the right work. situation. Yes. We, and it still creates impact, but it creates it creates things that are undeniable. This one you can say, yeah, everybody's saying what they want to say, and everybody you will listen to everybody because that's how it works. You, until you have had proof for anything, you're gonna listen to everybody. But those ones are undeniable because Fama was in the prison. So like, what do you want to tell me? That was there, so we knew. Like, we had we know the Nigerian prison system is corrupt. So my brother, so is this a lot more visible? <laughs> I don't Wait, know. I'm not is trying it? to make a point. I'm not trying I, to I think it's definitely point. more visible asking, to normal people. Is this a lot more visible? Yes, it is. Would it bring more attention to the of situation? Course, yes, sure. So why are we not looking at that possible positive? We're not not looking at the positive. I'm saying that we want things how. that are like, that will bring change, not just not talk. Just true, 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 true. That's my thing. Like, but the change is not even within the power of these people that are even doing all of these things. Yeah, why did they call them? The, so just went to charade. The people we go do implement the change now. I ain't call them so now. Abby. I hear you. I can't lie. I can't because I, there's nothing to. Say. I hear you, Timmy. You said enough. There's nothing to to say anymore. So this is tired of about talking. about anything. Queen, see, let the queen breathe. This oh, yes. has been an utmost pleasure. Thank you. I didn't know I was going to find this so interesting. I think you should <laughs> absolutely come back. You are mm. a vibe. Thank if Quincy does not, you know, say I mean, your I like, you go outside. And you like Quincy antagonizing me. It's you like cute. it? It's cute. It's cute. Yeah, right? it's not cute when you insult me, though. It's not. I'm not insulting no, you. I'm not. just factual. It's, not. it's daft and insult. It's I didn't not. even say you were daft. Did I say he was daft? It's okay. I said it was a daft thing. Look at you acting like a mediator. You <laughs> fucked up too, bro. What's your problem? Like, what did I do? I'm just saying, like, you okay. fucked up as well. Are you? What is that? Do you want a <laughs> chair? Do you want yeah, chairs and makeup? <laughs> Look me in the eye while you. No. It's a I'm thing. Sure it's a that. thing. <laughs> so you're not. You're not chair. Okay. <laughs> oh just, fuck! How that chair was? I was wondering. Oh, fuck what? off. Why did Quincy do that? But thank you guys so much. I absolutely enjoyed this. Quincy and Timmy B. It's thank been an you. honor and an utmost pleasure having both of you fun. in the studio with me on Zero Conditions. I so think you're an can amazing... Can I... One more last curse word? Mm. Mm. Yes, you can. Oh, fuck you, bro. You're an amazing, amazing person, Timmy B. And <laughs> um, of you. course, shout out to you for everything that you have been doing on radio. Thank you. To inspire like, the younger generation like us. Thank you. After you. I'm just saying you do great stuff as you do. Thanks. Thank you I'm also so young. Yeah. You're young, but you are, we are after you. Yeah. Who be the we? Me. I came after her. Like, no, she's like, yeah, you did. She's a legend. You're also old. Yeah, I am. By the way. All right. All right. Like, <laughs> Reminder. Who be we? You can follow us on social media at Zero Conditions Podcast. What do you guys want me to do? Oh, 
Use your mic, bro. <laughs> you can follow us at Zero Condition Podcast across our social media platform and subscribe to our YouTube channel at um, Zero Conditions. Please follow Timmy B at Timmy B. Yes. T A Y M I B. Yeah. On social media. And you can follow Quincy at Quincy Jones on social media. You don't have to follow me, it's fine. I don't know. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>